Hello everyone, I am Seth from Myriad Misadventures. It has been about two months since my last COVID-19 update vlog. With a couple exceptions like theme parks and movie theaters, the city has mostly opened back up and most people have gotten back to their lives. So in today's video, I'm gonna show you guys what the public transportation looks like here in Shenzhen right now. Unlike in cities that were harder hit like Wuhan, Shenzhen's public transportation never completely shut down. It's been open pretty much the whole time. So in this video, I'm gonna give you guys a peek at what it looks like right now. For the last couple weeks, I have been filming my trips on the buses and the subways so that you guys can see how busy or not busy they are right now. Leave me a comment down below telling me what the public transportation looks like, where you're from, if there is any. Um, is it still running? Did it shut down? Are there any extra rules that there weren't before? What's it look like? Dan's pretty excited. Alright, today is uh, April 26th. It's Sunday, uh, like 3.30. I'm taking the metro from Futian out to Shukou. So it's not super packed, but there's definitely more people than there were a couple months ago when I filmed the video. Alright, it's still April 26th and it's about 7.45 in the evening right now and I'm going back to Futian now. I'm at Wanxia Metro Station. Does not look too busy. We'll see how the metro looks. Not many people. I'm not often on this train, but I imagine that on a Sunday night, it's usually a little busier than this. Definitely less people than there were when I came out earlier this afternoon. So the subway picked up some people as it got closer to Futian. It probably had a similar number of people to when I was on it going out to Shoko. We have arrived at bus stop. We have one. All right, today is April 27th. I just took uh, the bus from my apartment to a, a nearby mall and there's not many people on it. There was maybe 10 people tops, but it's, uh, it's like it's like 12.30, 12.40. So it's not a particularly busy time for the bus, I don't think. I think for this time on a Monday, that's probably sort of normal, actually. I will try to take a bus during a busier time later to see if there's more people. All right, I just took the bus home maybe three hours later and there were at max eight people on it. So about the same as when I was going. All right, today is April 29th. I'm going to take the same bus I took a couple days ago. But I'm taking it a couple hours later. It is uh, a little after 6.30 now. So it's the same bus but a little later in the day, and I think there's probably gonna be some more people on it than when I took it the other day. All right, there were 19 people on the bus at its fullest. So that's probably at least twice as many people as were on the bus the other day when I took it. And in an hour or two, I'm gonna go back home on the same bus probably. So we'll see if the numbers have gone up or down by then. All right, I'm heading back now. It is 8.15, a little more than an hour and a half after I got here. I'm gonna be taking the same bus route back as I took here. And we're gonna see how busy it is. All right, uh, the bus home at its fullest had 10 people which is fewer than when I was taking it out the other way, but fuller than I expected it to be, honestly. On all the subways and buses right now, you have to scan one of these WeChat mini program QR codes to check in. All right, we're on the uh, 
Line 2 subway, just one stop. It's uh, the 30th of April and it's a little after 7. So it's a weekday, probably a little past rush hour. So probably a normal-ish amount of people, maybe a little less than normal. My today is May 1st, it's around 6.30, we're on line 4, which is the red one, we're going south. It's, uh, there's a bunch of people for a, uh, what day is today? Friday evening? Probably less than normal. The subway definitely wasn't empty, but I feel like Friday evening at 6.30, it should probably have more people than that. So still, uh, slightly fewer people out than normal. Max just reminded me that today is a holiday. It's uh, Labor Day, right? Yeah. Yeah, it's uh, China's Labor Day weekend this weekend from today, which is Friday, until next Tuesday, I think. So probably not many people were working. So maybe that's a normal metro for a, uh, a holiday. I'm not really sure. Uh, today is May 2nd, it's about 4 o'clock, it's still part of the Labor Day holiday, so there don't seem to be too many people out. It's about 5 now, we're back on the subway, this time we're on line 1, which is one of the busier lines, and there's definitely more people here than there were when we were on line 2 about an hour ago. It's uh, 7.30ish now, we're back on the green line. There's definitely more people now than there was earlier today. It's probably the busiest subway so far now. It's still May 2nd, it's uh, about 9 o'clock now, we're on the bus. There are 9 people, 9 people right now. Wednesday, May 6th, about 7.50 in the morning. Alright, so today is my first day back at work, which is why I'm on the bus so early. And it was pretty full. I've seen it more full in the morning, but that was definitely the most full of any of the buses that I've taken in the last week or week and a half. All right, so today is Thursday, May 7th. It's a little after eight. And kind of looks like uh, for the morning commute at least, the buses, or at least my bus, are mostly back to normal. They seem pretty full yesterday's and today's. Today is Saturday, May 9th. It's about 7.50 in the morning, and we're gonna see how the bus is today. Today's a Saturday, but it might be a working day, so I'm not quite sure how it's gonna be. I imagine Saturday mornings are usually less busy than workday mornings, but if today's actually a work day because of the holiday last weekend, then it could be just as busy as normal. Still don't know if it's a, uh, an official work day or not today for like the Monday to Friday, nine to five people. But uh, the bus was still pretty busy. Maybe a little less busy than the last couple days, but comparable. Still May 9th, it's uh, like 12, 12, 15 right now, quarter past 12. I am going to hop on the subway to go grab some lunch. So we'll see if there's like a big lunch rush that's really packed or anything. I'm not sure how far out people often venture for lunch, so I don't know if it'll be busy or not. The station is pretty empty though. Not many people, just a couple, just a handful of other people, but not too many. Not like super packed or anything, but it was pretty busy. Restaurants look busy, plenty of people eating. Not really public transportation though, kind of inside. All right, it is almost 1.30 now. All finished with lunch, gonna head back to work. See how the subway looks compared to an hour or an hour and a half earlier when I was on it before. I think it'll probably be a little less busy. I bet a lot of people who might have been out for lunch before are probably back to work now. So if I had to guess, I'd say not quite as busy as before. Maybe I was wrong.
pretty similar, I guess. There were more people than I expected there to be. Maybe I just haven't ridden the subway for a very long time. Don't remember how many people there usually are. All right, today is uh, May 11th. It's just after 7.45. I just got off the bus. It was a little less busy today. Uh, not quite all of the seats were taken and I was the only person standing. Uh, but I probably took the bus 10 to 20 minutes earlier than I was taking it last week. Uh, I was probably one or two buses before the one I took last week. So it might have been less busy just because I missed the uh, early morning rush. Today is May 12th. It's just after 5.30. Today I'm going to take the bus home. Normally I walk home from work, but today I'll take the bus and see how busy it is. Almost empty actually. All right, there weren't many people on that bus, uh, including me and the driver, there were only 11. Uh, last semester I took the next bus, so I don't know if this bus was less busy because of COVID-19 stuff or because it's just an earlier bus. Thank you everyone for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like and remember to subscribe so you can see when I have new videos. And if you have any questions, leave them down below in the comments and I will do my best to answer them.